Well, it's a beautiful day, if a little bit smoky, so I am going to take the opportunity to do my first ride up into the mountains for a couple of weeks. It is certainly a little hazy, smoky. Can't even barely see the mountains. Ten months after it blew up on the beach, the infamous Vancouver barge is slowly disappearing being taken apart piece by piece. It is just as smoky up the sound as it is in Vancouver. Kind of big. It was a quick ride up. Love coming up here on during the week. Traffic's usually pretty light. Most of them know where they're going, so they're going fast. Just turned off on uh, the Mam Quam. Get to be out riding again on the dirt. Not a lot of people here. It's been so long, I can't remember where I'm going. Too long away from it. Hi. Good. Did you guys happen to catch the signs back there about the bridge being closed? No. 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 Uh, I'm going too fast. <laughs> I'm like, what, what, what? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but it was like absolutely no traffic. No, it was on this branch, so it's something up ahead. We'll find it. Yeah. For cars, <laughs> not bicycles and motorcycles, right? <laughs> Have a good ride. but not really. 17 degrees up here. 10 mile mark. Those are good, but they've put some little cutouts on the way up. 
have to watch your speed. Those are new, I think. Yeah, I don't feel any need to go farther than this. I think I'll go back and take the other line. Yeah, I'll take Nam Clam instead of Indian Arm, which is what I'm on right now. And we go up to uh, Scoopin' Creek. We'll have a look at that. Good afternoon. Oh, there's a light. Yes, this one's lovely. Back down at the bottom of Indian Arm. And I'm gonna go up the Mam Quam. Yeah, so they're taking that bridge out tonight. Could be out for a month, from what the sign says. Should be rude shock. This is Refuse Creek campsite down there. Oh, a bunch of trucks going out just at the beginning of the road. Haven't seen anybody since. Nice. Definitely not a great day for photography because everything's so drab. Trying to do a little follow me, and I ran her into the trees. But she seems okay. Just cut a few leaves. Give her one more try. Why not? Dryer. 
Uh oh. Well, I've crashed my drone trying to do follow me. Wasn't high enough to clear these big trees. So she ran into them. And uh, I'm trying to use the find me thing, but it's pretty thick foliage. And uh, oh my god, there it is. Unbelievable. She looks a little bent up. Poor little thing. The crops are okay. Wow. I wonder. Oh, no, she's missing a propeller here. But that's okay. I've got other propellers. Cool. Well, I'll take her back up and put another prop on and see if she'll fly. Just have to get back up there. Hard to believe, but I found the drone in that mess. But she's got two propellers broken. And I have two propellers with me. I'm not sure if they're the right ones because there's two different types. And I don't have a screwdriver, so it doesn't matter. So I'll go up here for a bit and then probably head home. See if I can do it without breaking anything further. This is still a great ride up here, though, but yeah, crappy visibility. No pretty pictures today. She's just too cloudy and smoky. Turn around here. I've been leaving the ABS off uh, because I was watching a video by Brett Trax, and he was basically saying that with the modern ABS, it'll stop you faster than then he, you know, an experienced rider can stop the bike in gravel. And uh, yes, you sometimes want to slide your back wheel going around corners and stuff, but most of the time you don't. You certainly don't want to slide the front wheel. So like here, yeah, you don't have a lot of braking power though on like a steep hill like this. So, I'm just not worrying about it. I mean, I would probably, if I was doing a very steep hill, I would make sure it was off, but this is a pretty steep hill and you don't really need it. And for the front, you don't have to worry nearly so much about her locking up on uh, loose gravel, because that you definitely don't want. Ooh, it's very turquoise today. Lots of silt 